Welcome to the week ahead. Headlines. Special Parliament session to approve debt restructuring process likely. Sri Lanka and Iran in oil for tea barter program. Electricity tariff cut likely. Colombo inflation for June to be released. A special parliamentary session is likely to be held this weekend to approve Sri Lanka's domestic debt restructuring process. This is according to the Daily Mirror, citing a spokesman from the Speaker's office, which stated that on Tuesday, a special party leader's meeting is to take place to decide on whether to hold a parliament session on Saturday, July 1st and Sunday, July 2nd to approve the debt process. With the government declaring a special bank holiday on Friday 30th, there is much speculation on whether such a framework will be announced next week. According to the Daily FT, this would allow a five-day stability or cooling-off period for the economy and financial services sector. From July, Sri Lanka will likely commence an oil for tea barter program with Iran. Niraj Demel, chairman of the Sri Lanka Tea Board, speaking to Reuters, said that initially tea to the value of $2 million would be sent to Iran, although the agreement was to send $5 million worth for four years. Under the program, the oil purchaser Ceylon Petroleum Corp will give the tea board Sri Lankan rupees to ship tea to Sri Lankan exporters. There, tea importers in Iran will pay the country's national Iranian oil company in Iranian rials. From Saturday, July 1st, electricity charges are likely to be reduced. This follows a 3% reduction proposed by the Ceylon Electricity Board. Such was in doubt as this decision had to be approved by the Public Utilities Commission of Sri Lanka, who, until last week, had its chairman post vacant. On Friday, Mr. Manjula Fernando was appointed to this position. On Friday, Colombo-centric inflation for June will be released. Inflation has been trending lower since March, and this is likely to continue. In May, overall inflation fell significantly to 25.2%, with food prices increasing 21.5%. According to Dr. Nandalal Weerasinghe, governor of the central bank, inflation is declining at a faster pace than initially thought, and is hoped to be within the expected range before the end of the year. And that's a wrap for this week. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and leave a like below to stay updated on the latest developments in Sri Lanka. Until next time, have a great day.